Welcome. In this video, we will look at solutions that optimize the usage of helium as a carrier gas in GC and GCMS instrumentation. The current shortage of the supply of helium gas for use in laboratory analysis is causing several problems. These include difficulty in production planning, uncertainty in instrument productive uptime and unpredictable supply costs. There are alternative options, such as using hydrogen as a carrier gas, but this may present safety challenges and requires significant efforts in method conversion and validation. There are also some industries whose regulated methods still mandate the use of helium carrier gas, so other gases can't be considered. The safest and most ideal solutions for mitigating the effects of the helium shortage should enable laboratories to maintain their current methods and conserve the usage of helium to reduce the dependency on gas supplies while saving on supply costs. The Thermo Scientific Instant Connect Helium Saver Module is an innovation designed to mitigate the effects of the helium crisis in the GC and GCMS industry. This is a user-installable Instant Connect GC injector module that can easily be placed into the gas chromatograph. It allows a single cylinder of helium to last up to 14 years under certain conditions or for the lifetime of most GCMS instruments. The module offers a lifetime helium carrier gas solution for GC and GCMS instrumentation while keeping existing methodology. Unlike other helium conservation options on the market, the Helium Saver module is always in use and works while your instrument is running or idle. This solution enables you to maintain your current methods, prolong your supply and also save your budget. The premise of the technology is simple. The use of helium is optimised by an innovative GC inlet which is supplied with two gases. Nitrogen is used for septum purge and split flows, while helium is only used to feed the analytical column flow. This eliminates wastage of helium in a standard GC inlet. The split ratio and the helium carrier gas flow through the analytical column remain the same as your existing method. During the injection period, helium is nearly closed off and nitrogen flows into the column for sample introduction. Helium is supplied at a minimal flow of 0.1 millimetres per minute to keep the connection swept during injection. When the GC is in standby mode and not running samples, it can be left in this condition with almost no consumption of helium. In the GC run phase, helium is supplied with a flow that is just slightly higher than the column flow. The head pressure of nitrogen ensures that helium carrier gas is delivered at the desired flow into the column. This ensures the same separation efficiency obtained with standard split or splitless injections. The gas switch between the injection and the run phase is immediate as demonstrated here. During the injection phase in this example, which is performed in splitless mode for one minute, only nitrogen flows into the column. The chromatographic signal, as seen in the top of the screen, and the MS spectrum reflect the large amount of nitrogen reaching the single quadrupole mass spectrometer. After the one minute splitless injection occurs, helium starts flowing into the column. We can still observe a high nitrogen signal for another 30 seconds or so, which corresponds to the column void time. Exactly when helium reaches the end of the column and MS detector, the chromatographic signal drops and the MS spectrum is the typical background observed with helium carrier gas. 
The proper water-nitrogen ratio in the spectrum and the sharp signal drop clearly show how quickly the system switches from nitrogen to helium with no downtime. A case study was conducted to determine the effectiveness of the helium saver technology when used in regulated US EPA method 8270 featuring the analysis of semi-volatiles with GCMS technology. The results obtained when using the helium saver technology were almost identical to the results obtained when using the conventional methods. For example, retention times remained unchanged, as did precision and split ratio accuracy. Calibration curves were still accurate and overall results are almost identical. The helium saver technology also enabled a reduction in the amount of helium gas required for the analysis. When considering continuous, uninterrupted, around-the-clock analysis, the lifetime of a single cylinder of helium is expected to increase from just five months to over 3.5 years. This results in significant financial savings and assurance in supply. The resulting data demonstrates that this technology can be used to perform regulated analysis that utilise helium as a carrier gas, while allowing the laboratory to significantly reduce the amount of helium used during each run. The lifetime of a single cylinder of helium can be significantly extended with the use of the helium saver technology as shown here. As you can see with the helium saver module, under certain conditions you could only need one helium cylinder for the lifetime of your GC or GCMS instrument. There are many innovative features of the Instant Connect helium saver module and these offer unique benefits. This technology enables you to continue your analysis without helium supply concerns or extensive supply costs. Save precious non-renewable noble helium during the analytical run as well as when your instrument is idle. Since all of your analytical conditions remain the same, the retention time does not change. Keep your methods intact, validation effective and regulation compliant. Significant savings can be realised in helium supply throughout the lifetime of your GC or GCMS instrument. We have a variety of resources which offer a deeper look into helium market conditions, their implications on helium supply in analytical labs and the benefits of the helium saver technology. For access to these resources and to find out more information on the Thermo Scientific Instant Connect Helium Saver module, visit thermoscientific.com forward slash helium saver.